Hi YouTubers, it's me again. I'm back with some more movie reviews. Today, these movies came back, have come out today. Taken, Passenger, Baby on Board, S. Darko, and a movie that's already been out for a long, for a while now is Donnie Darko. Okay, well, all of you guys are going to think this is kind of weird, especially for a person who likes to watch movies, but I've actually never really seen Donnie Darko in full. In full. I only caught glimpses here and there. So, my personal thing, I thought this movie was really good. I give it about a 9. It was very well done, very well thought out. The story was really good. The bunny was kind of creepy, though. But I really liked it. It was really good. Good movie, good plot. Now, the sequel. S. Darko. Samantha Darko. I give this one about a five or a six. It it was stupid. It, it didn't. There's parts of it that it was okay. It was good. And then there's parts I was just like, okay, why this? Why are they doing this? Never explained it. And Donnie Darko, at least a lot of it was. Some most of it was explained. Samantha Dark wasn't really very much explained except that people were dying, coming back, and that was it. It's. Eh, like I said, I give it about a six. So if you do want to see this, it's out. It just came out today. Another movie that came out is Baby on Board. This is this is okay, kind of funny. I give this movie another six. It um, about a lady and a boyfriend. They uh, have sex for some failure to the condom or something. She gets pregnant, and they go through all these issues. The only funny, really funny parts in this movie was the fart jokes. That's the only thing that really saved this movie was the fart jokes. If you like a good fart joke. Check us. Check out Baby on Board. Now, the last two movies. I say these two movies because you gotta say the best for last. The Passengers and Hathaway's first actual true drama was a really good movie. It it happens after it happens after a plane has crashed and for some odd mysterious reason, the survivors are starting to disappear. They're Nobody knows what's going on. Nobody knows what's happening. All they know is that there's something going on with the the fl the flight or or the um the company that had made these airplanes. I'm not gonna give away the ending because the move it was a really surprise. It was a good surprise. And for Anne Hathaway's first true drama, I'll give her a nine. This was a good movie, and hopefully we can see her like maybe in a, a good horror movie or something. You know, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about that. Now, the best for last, Taken. This is an awesome movie. I give this movie a 10. One of the best action movies I've seen so far. If you remember Mel Gibson's Ransom, it's kind of like that, but a lot better. And instead of offering a million dollars, this guy has nothing. All he has is a bunch of skills. And he will find you. And he will kill you. It's an awesome, awesome movie. And it just keeps you into the movie. It keeps you going. You're like, holy crap, what the... Oh my goodness, this is... What just happened here? He really gets into the people. And you're cheering him on all the way. I mean, it's a father saving his daughter. What parent wouldn't like this movie? So, again, Taken. All these movies are out today. And Donnie Darko has been out for a while. So, if you're interested in these movies, check them out. Go to your local Blockbuster or home video store. And... Hey, give me some ratings. Let me know what you think. Um, oh, and please, don't forget to subscribe.